Hey guys, for my project, I'm going to be doing a military homecoming. This is Johnny. He came home from Missouri to surprise his girlfriend, Ember, who's one of my really good friends. And this is Jenna. She's also a military girlfriend. And we have her in on it, and we told Ember that she's going to be doing an interview about military girlfriends. But she doesn't know that Johnny's here, and we're going to surprise her. So let's get into it. Hello, I'm Private First Class Marina. I'm from Brick, New Jersey. I joined the Corps because ever since I was little, I've always wanted to be in the Corps. We go through this boot camp, which is 13 weeks. It's in South Carolina. Anyone on the East Coast goes to that one. It's actually one of the most hardest and endorsed training. After the 13 weeks, we have 10 day leave to go back to see our families because within the 13 weeks, we're actually not allowed to talk to any of them. We have no communication. What's it like to be away from your girlfriend and how do you keep in touch? It was actually hard at first when um, I went off to boot camp because as you guys all know, military uh, relationships don't normally last that long. Um, the good thing about us is that we trust each other. I trust her to um, stay loyal and faithful when I was there, as well as her feeling the same way. Uh, for the 13 weeks, like I previously said once again, that we weren't allowed to have any contact. So it was kind of hard. And once I got to Missouri, we were, we were, I got my phone back and we were able to actually FaceTime. Did you meet your girlfriend and how long have you guys been dating? Well, I met her at the at my job before I went to the Corps. Uh, she was actually a good friend of uh, my, one of my co-workers and she would come in and visit her. And then from there, we started talking. We became pretty close friends and yeah, it escalated as into a relationship. When did you guys become official? right before I actually shipped out to boot camp. What are your thoughts on today and are you excited to see her? Oh well, I texted you uh, to surprise her. I was giving out any ideas because I'm not romantic that way. And um, we came up with this great plan and I decided to go through with it. I'm really excited to see her because I haven't seen her in over two months. And. I would like to see her reaction on how she feels, and see if she would feel the same way and excited as I am to see her. Hi, I'm Jenna. I'm one of Ember's friends, and I'm also a military girlfriend. My boyfriend actually happened to go through boot camp at the same time and in the same platoon as Johnny. So they were actually friends without us knowing, which was kind of funny. And I'm really excited to surprise her. I saw I wanted to be a part of it today because I kind of relate on a more personal level. Alright, so tell us a little about your boyfriend. What's his name? Where's he from? And what part of the military is he? His name's Matt. He's from Bricktown, New Jersey. Actually the same town as Johnny. And he's in the, in the Marines for I actually was friends with his brother for four years before I ever met Matt. I thought his brother was an only child for four years. I met his whole family before him, including his parents and everyone else, his brother obviously. And we were at a concert one summer and like he came to join all of us and I had no idea who he was so I asked his brother, I was like, who's that kid? He's so random. And he's like, just turned and looked at me and he's like, that's my brother. And I was like, four years. I thought he was the only child. Little did I know. <laughs> that's awesome. And we just started hanging out from there and then we ended up building into a relationship before he left for boot camp. So how long have you been in a relationship now? Officially dating? We've been dating for a little over six months now. I kind of like fall off the books a little bit before that. <laughs> and do you guys keep in touch well, very often, I assume? All the time. We text uh, every day when he's not in class and we FaceTime, not every night, but Whenever he has free time, we FaceTime. So how did you meet Ember? We had a lot of mutual friends, and I don't remember how we officially met, but we kind of just like, through that friend group, like slowly started hanging out by ourselves and realized we had a lot in common. And we just got really close in the last year. We think that you and Ember are better friends now because you're both military girlfriends? 
I think in a way that we are because it was something that was completely different for both of us and it brought us a lot closer because it was something that we kind of like figured out together and it was nice to have someone to lean on that knew like exactly what I was going through at, at the same time that I was going through it. So I definitely think it brought us closer as friends. Hi, my name is Ember. I'm from Point Pleasant. Um, my boyfriend's name is Johnny and he's in the Marines and he's stationed in Missouri. So what's it like to date someone in the military? Um, so since I've been friends with Johnny for such a long time, we honestly used to hang out all the time. So like when he did leave, it was a lot more difficult than I thought just because we, we would hang out all the time, like almost every day. And when he left, it was hard to just like talk over the phone or text or FaceTime like when he could, because he couldn't always be able to use his phone. And it's different having someone so far away that like you can't just like drive down the street and be like, hey, like I'm coming to get you. So how do you like keep in contact? Um, well, since I work a lot, when I get out of work, we try FaceTiming, but if not, it's mostly through text messaging or phone calls. And you think that this relationship is like a lot different than if you were dating someone outside of the military? I think so, yeah, because at times, like, when I would want to call him and be like, hey, like, can you just please come over, like, for, like, the hard times or, like, anything like that, like, I can't, like, you have to call them or, like, talk to them, like, through FaceTime, and, like, he's so busy and I'm so busy, it's just a lot more difficult. So, my boyfriend was supposed to be home by Thanksgiving. <laughs> for real? That's not funny. <laughs> what is for you? Thank you. Uh, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stop, there's I don't. He said everything for his license was being mailed to him. So, yeah, good cover up, though. <laughs> Are we done now? <laughs> I guess so. Howdy. So, all this time, everybody thought this was going to be a surprise. Planned it for a week, you know. Turns out Johnny had her pick her up from the airport. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my Thanks for watching! <laughs>